Now, look, I don't know if it's true, but I just seen somebody say Fulio died and he got 32 times. Now, listen, I've been really looking into numbers, and shit, but if I'm not mistaken, 32 is 23 backwards. And he died this morning, which is 623, 2024. Now, if I'm not mistaken, when I used to watch the When I See You video and listen to the song, the n he dissed the most was 23 because it was 23 birthday when Young and Ace and them all got popped up in the car. Now, I don't know how karma works. I don't know if you believe in it. I don't know if I believe in it. But at the same time, in the same token, I just find that kind of weird and ironic that like, now, nah, if that got killed by like a Glock 23, oh yeah, he, it was his time. Then the crazy thing about it, his girlfriend on social media talking about, we need to stop the violence. Fulio was the violence. Family, we are back. Y'all know what to do. Thanks for being here. Y'all know how I feel about time. Anyway, um, we got to talk about it. The girlfriend responded, but also bro's top op. Hmm. I watched this song go from 50,000 to 1.1 1 .1 something million within 17 hours yeah um Young and Ace Fulio alright so here's the thing y'all Young and Ace is a Jacksonville rapper he and his brothers were celebrating uh brothers one of the brothers 18th birthday and they called him 23 the person whose B day it was. So, um, some things happened. And here it is, June 23rd, on somebody else's birthday. Some things happened. My cousin sent me a picture, and I had to tell my cousin straight up. Let me know before you send me some sh stuff like that. Because how it look is it's, it's nothing you don't send without a warning. Y'all. didn't make it in a hotel but one thing I will say is he had a really 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 calm energy to the point where it feels like he knows the energy he was inviting it was almost as if he was tired for real for real like man if it's gonna happen it's gonna happen I know it's cash on my head and whatever, whatever. F it. I'm going to be here. I'm going to be there. I'm here. I'm there. Yeah. I don't think he was backdoored or anything. I really don't. You can't backdoor a person that's given their every move to, to the public, to social media. You can't backdoor a person like that. He made a post not too long ago, y'all. He said that he know it's going to be soon or something, but he's getting all the fake love from around him. Interesting. But another thing is, um, oh my God, what was I going to say? I totally forgot what I was going to say. Anyway, let's get to this video. I'm talking too much anyways. Um, let's get to the video. I forgot Shorty's name, but yeah, let's go. 
Spears was looking for a response from another rapper who goes by the name of Young and Ace. But from what I was able to put together, you guys, this is a feud that's been going on a while now in between Young and Ace, his homeboy Fallout Sosa, as well as Julio. Ace's homeboy Sosa had took to his Instagram story, you guys, and he said, do y'all research and let me know if Julio passed away or not. I'm trying to see something. More than likely, once he received news that Fulio had indeed passed away, you guys, that's when all of the fun and games started for them. Ace's homeboy Sosa wasted no time reposting people's memories that they were posting that they had had with Fulio while also saying OMG across the photo with a whole bunch of laughing emojis. He went on to say that spaces will never be the same. And if y'all don't know what spaces is, it's basically Instagram live, but for Twitter and it's audio It's not necessarily video footage. And he posted this music to go along with the post. Uh -huh. He also reposted what Charleston White had to say about Julio Fulio passing away. And then he posted, I can't get over the fact that this ninja passed away at a holiday inn. Poor a double -S ninja. He then the disrespecting, y'all. And I'm not, I don't condone it. And I'm not trying to come at either party. But that's exactly what it is, the disrespecting. Because we know Fulio was a fool with the disrespect. I wonder why these people just stay in Florida like that. Y'all got money to go across the country. Some can even leave the country. But they stay in these hot areas where they got the smoke at. For what reason? I don't know. Anyway, let's continue his instagram story a tweet from his twitter that read my favorite liquor is don julio now it's merch and then the next thing you know he's posting this video of him drinking it hey, get out that don julio And then Jaden Youngin also posted on his Instagram story about Fulio passing away, and this is what he said. June 23rd. And the girlfriend of Fulio even came out and posted on her Twitter once she received confirmation that her boyfriend Fulio had passed away. Now, as a 26-year-old male, the last thing I'm going to do is probably period just the last thing i want to do is perform on my birthday for real for real i would be somewhere laid up what yeah said y'all took my boyfriend from me i hate y'all and i won't be the only one crying young girlfriend in the tweet that she had created he went on to say lol this really my blood brother baby mama going this hard for fulio itch your son look like me talking about y'all took my boyfriend up that ninja hey today a good day to be alive brother. Hey, full part of the day at six and then another rapper who goes by the name of Spinabans even had this to say about hearing the news of Fulio passing away. He put a whole bunch of laughing emojis and someone tagged him and said, this ish is funny to you. He went on to say, it's a proud day to be an American. Fulio's fans and supporters, as well as all of the ones who were involved in the whole altercation in between Young and Ace and Fulio, should know that people were waiting to hear what he had to say about Fulio passing away. But instead of giving us a reaction, you guys, he dropped a whole... A whole song, y'all. This is what people are saying. He had a week to make this song. <clears throat> what they mean is... He made the song when bro passed out the flyers on um, social media. Not passed them out, but posted them. Mm, mm, mm. <coughs> 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 Look, rapper Young and Ace admits to putting it out on him when y'all hear it listen i don't i'm not i don't think i'm gonna play the song 
I don't think I'm gonna play this song because um, I know this got to be getting some money. Real talk, but y'all heard him catch his ass, do his ass. Same day that he passed away. I ain't shit. I ain't a bitch. And did a remix to Fantasia's song "When I See You." Hey, but Ace survived. And fast forward to today, but Ace survived See, because Young and Ace went out on his birthday, and four people got pow pow at, and three people passed away, but Ace survived. And fast forward to today, you guys, Fulio went out on his birthday, and four people got pow pow at, and three people survived. However, Fulio mm. passed away, and people are just saying that's crazy. Leave your thoughts and opinions down below, you guys, and let me know what y'all think about the entire situation <clears throat> yeah that's where we are with that y'all and it's so crazy because it ain't like the people can't put it together let's be real um i don't know if i want to get into this next video just yet yeah i'm not gonna do it we can wait on that one we definitely can yeah let me know what you guys think though I really feel like this has ATK all over it ATK they say allegedly stands for Aces Top yeah where I feel like Fulio messed up y'all is being so open dropping the locations being so comfortable only three hours away from all the smoke yeah and it's just so crazy it could have got it could have been to the point where hey let's holler at this promoter tell him to book Fulio mm. cash happened on the, the front end we'll pay this to do this on this day it was too orchestrated it was too orchestrated and the, 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 the reason I say Jesus I just remixed that but the reason I say too orchest orchestrated is because the situations, the coincidences, the birthday coincidence, the 23rd coincidence. Come on, man. Anyway, let me know your thoughts. Let me know where you're tapping in from. I'm out. Peace. Just knew they would go get him because the boy works hard to get guy. No, no, the world works hard to get out on. Man, they shot their foot off last year, give him that pirate nub. Uh, man, he supposed to still he got his foot shot off, ain't supposed to be bouncing around on his birthday. Man, get somewhere and sit down and rest that foot and work your hips. Man, he supposed to be f***ing. And then I'm thinking, at the holiday end, what the f***? Man, it's, man, there ain't no protection on a nigga at the holiday end. They ain't got valet parking. <laughs> no, man. Shit, no, man. That, man, that's why I go, man, the holiday in. Man, I guess when you got an entourage rolling around, you can't go get one of them high dollar rooms. Yeah, no. You got to go, yeah. Yeah, no, you need to get up yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, and everybody saying, well, man, what you think about this? Well, uh, all I'm going to say is, man, that nigga works hard to die. Did he earn this here? Uh, and damn it, uh, should nobody be sad? Yeah. Where that nigga lived and talked gangster? Uh, should nobody be sad what did happen to, to, to Julio Fulio? Uh, one thing we know about it, he didn't go to heaven. I say good, wasn't it? Yeah, now one thing about it, he ain't in heaven. Now, nah, where that boy, he, listen, he had all the time in the world to apologize to them people. He was going to the graveyard, rapping at the graveyard. Man, that making people mama cry so it's some people relieved wiping their forehead saying oh lord thank you and then there's some people crying said oh we gonna miss one leg one foot oh we could that's you that, that's what the indians would call him the indians give you a name black foot uh light foot uh yeah, yeah the indians come pale up with skin. yeah 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 pale skin uh yeah yeah so you know we go uh yeah 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 so Jacksonville rapper Julio Fulio got on his birthday last night. His car was shot over 30 times a couple months ago and they only shot him in the foot. He survived that one and he was in rehab. But if you look at his Instagram story last night, he dropped his location multiple times. 
So pretty much Julio Fulio came out the hotel last night with his little entourage. They got in two separate cars. Guys pulled over the rifles. Like some military type shit. They wanted him gone, bro. Julio Fulio was in a dark black charger. And I seen a video on Twitter. I can't put it on TikTok or they gonna ban me, but they shot that Dodge Charger up so many times. They wanted this man gone so bad, bro. But he gotta blame himself. All the trolling this man undid, and he got a nerve to drop his location, bro. After so many people want you dead. Crazy, man. R.P. Fulio.